Hey, I'm gonna tell you something. Christmas come early for me. Christmas come early for me. You never guess what. You're gonna be proud of me. Every one of you gonna be proud of me because last night, I don't know how to break the news to you. This is gonna be unbelievable for your ears. This, I'm so proud of myself. Listen to me. Any, any girl over five foot, I am not dating anymore. I don't want to know you. I don't want to get to know you. It's not going to work out. Any woman over five foot that was interested in me, it's not going to work out. Listen, I had the time of my life last night. She was only four foot five. You understand? Four foot five. She, hey, let me tell you something. Yeah, let me tell you something. I'm going into the situation with dwarf and midgets, right? I don't know if people stop saying midget, but they're saying dwarf, short people, mini people, small people. I am into it, okay? This little dwarf, aka midget, rock my world. Rock my world. Somebody says rock my world with me. Say rock my world. Listen to me. I mean, six foot and over five foot, uh, well, five foot eight, uh, five foot nine, five foot four, five foot. You got nothing on these dwarfs. You understand? As big as I am, this, this little dwarf was spinning me around, doing things to me, flipping me over like I was the fucking dwarf. I, like I was the midget. You understand? I hope I don't offend them by using the wrong terminology. When she come back later on, I'm going to have to ask her what's the right terminology to use. Is it dwarf or is it midget or is it small people? You understand? Listen to me. I was being tossed like a kebab. I was rotisserie. I was going around like I'm on a fucking rotisserie. You get me? I'm tossed. I've been tossed like I was on a fucking stir fry. You understand? Listen to me, this little, for all men out there, stop dating tall woman, uh, big woman, grown up woman. Find yourself a little dwarf. Find yourself a little midget, okay? And you will have the time of your life. You will never look back. Once you go dwarf, you will never go back. Once you go midget, you will never go back. Listen to me, find yourself one of them. I'm now, I'm going... I am going to even buy a ring to put on my own fucking finger. Even when she don't want to marry me, I'm going to buy a ring. I'm going to put one on her finger when she's sleeping. And I'm going to put one on my finger when I'm... One on my finger. I was about to say when I'm sleeping. I can't fucking put it on when I'm fucking sleeping, can I? Anyway, I'm going to buy two ring. One for her. Put it on when she's sleeping. And I'm going to throw some rose petal over the bed when I get paid this weekend. I'm going to go shop and buy, buy a ring. Buy two ring. One for her, one for me. I'm going to put... When she's sleeping, she's going to wake up with two glasses of wine beside her, rose petal, chocolate, and the ring I'm going to put on her finger. Yes, it might cost 200 pounds, but a ring is a ring. You understand? And some people go out and buy this expensive ring, and before you know it, their husband leave them. I am going to get something cheap and something simple for now, okay? Big men, men out there that looking for a woman, find yourself a dwarf, aka midget. You're, going, you're never going to look back. You're going to be so proud. Oh my God, my world was rock last night. Oh, this, this poor little dwarf destroyed my little willy. Destroyed my willy. Put, I almost had to put out of service on my willy. Can you catch your breath? If you ever... Listen, leave me a subscribe, leave me a follow and let me know what you think about the situation. Women that are looking as well, go and find yourself a little dwarf man or a little midget man. That man can fit up there inside you, ladies. I'm telling you, the things that he's going to do to you, you, you can, he will, he, he will fit where he needs to fit. I'm telling you, Shabadineya.